DuvalSports.com, Dream King Films. We're here with Derek Smith of the Trend of Conquerors. Hey, man, it's February 1st, National Sign of the Day. Talk about the feeling real quick, bro. It's a regular feeling. It's truly a blessing, you know. Been through a lot in my last four years, and just to have the opportunity to go play at Miami, it's a great feeling. Yes, sir. Um, talk about some of the adversity you went through um, over the years, um, some of the ups and downs with this recruitment process. Well, it was a lot of ups and downs um, going, with deciding where I was going to go at, and um, my freshman, my sophomore year, my film was deleted, so that changed a lot of the of my recruit process. So it started going, going crazy. Talk about starting from the bottom and building your way back up to the top, getting more film on tape for these uh, coaches who wasn't convinced that uh, ultimately offer you a scholarship. Well, first, uh, like it started off by me. I just, I just kept praying every day, every night, and going. I had the mindset where well, I know what I got to do and I know what I wanted to do. So like. Um, Going out with that mindset every day and every time I step on the field, it just I, I know I, I know what I had to do and I did it, and it, it just I guess I caught somebody out. Yes, sir. Talk about your skill set. What makes you so good, and how can you go down there to the bottom and compete right away? Well, uh, uh, what I have to emphasize is that I have the size already, and plus I have the ability to I'm, I'm fast at my size and I can move, and so I feel like that's going to be a big impact to me on uh, playing. Yes, sir. Darian Owens out of Old Leaf. He already down there at Miami. Shaq Quarterman, Mike Peeney. You got Norton that played at Trinity. He's in Miami. Bradley Jennings, Marshall Few from out of Ponte Vedra, Augie DiBiase from Reigns. Talk about y'all Jacksonville guys getting together, going down to the bottom and making a statement. Well, I feel like we're going to really make a statement. Because I feel like we're going to get more Jacksonville kids just because they see that we're going down there and make an impact because I'm trying to come down there and make an impact. And Shaq and Peeney. All those guys already made impact down there, so I, I feel like people from Jacksonville are really feel like Miami. They believe in Miami. Yes, sir. A lot of a lot of kids here in the Jacksonville area follow you. They follow Trinity Christian football. What you got to say to the youth out there um, in the city of Jacksonville? Um, well, I would like to tell the, um, the youth that to always keep working hard and always pray. Is most 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 importantly, you should. Always just academics. That's that's the most important thing. Academics, like without the academics, you can't go nowhere. Yes, sir. Hey, one more time, man. Talk about that smile you put on your parents' face. Well, I know my mom. She went out throughout throughout the days. Uh, happy, she was smiling and on and out tears. And my dad, he was happy too. And I know they just happy that I'm not going in the wrong direction. I'm going on the right path. Yes, sir. Your little brother, Deidre Smith, he was just recently offered a scholarship to Miami. How proud of you is your little brother following in your footsteps? I'm, I'm very proud of my little brother. He's actually he's doing better than I was throughout the recruitment process. He's already starting out.